So for many years we've been uh, doing commentary on the TT and this would be the time you would be starting to get excited about uh, being at Ballacrane up at the bungalow. But more lately people will associate the name Roy Moore and the face that I've got uh, to being at Ramsey Hairpin. But we've moved a bit further down the road for 2023 and 23 is involved in, uh, in that sign as well because it's 23 miles into a lap of the TT mountain course that the riders go past Milntown Estate at about 150 or 160 miles per hour onto Lazare Road, down through Schoolhouse Corner and into Parliament Square. So it's a new venture this year. We're going to be based here through Duke. We've been appointed to keep people entertained at Milntown Estate and that will be fairly straightforward as far as I'm concerned but what a joy they've got not only will they be looked after with food and beverage and tea and coffee and unlimited facilities in that once they're parked up on the individual race days but they will be getting a spectator view which will be second to none and entirely theirs we'll show you that later but for the moment, from a bit of a breezy Lazare Road, I think the race would still go ahead. Doesn't look much uh, missed on the west side of the course. Looking to the right, you will spot uh, the climb out of Ramsey up onto the mountain course and everything looks good if racing was to go ahead today. So this is where the marquee is going to be. It's only a short walk then to where the viewing area will be. And that will be next on the agenda for us. So if you can picture the marquee, as it will be. Certainly, I think it's coming from the Peel direction to be erected here on Wednesday. It'll be all in place. We give you that assurance ready for your hospitality down here at Milntown Estate in Ramsey on the world famous 37 and 3 quarter miles TT mountain course. So only cars on offer at the moment, uh, both ways, both directions and lots of activity. But when the racing starts and you'll hear the bikes approaching well before the Ginger Hall, down the newly refurbished Sulby Strait, in fact, you'll start to get tense and you'll get all excited as you hear them down through the box, up through the box, as they're fast approaching us here at Milntown. Looking back down the road, that's the exit from Pinfold Cottage the very tricky little left-right section that goes through there. And coming out of Pinfold Cottage then, it'll be a case then of getting it onto the gas as much as possible. When they go over Milntown Bridge, the front will come up and that will give the spectators here on the, the scaffolding and the grandstand area at Milntown a tremendous look across the road. And then the wheel will come down and they'll get it lined up on some particular point we don't know what it's going to be, but when they find that particular point, it will be over to the right and then down the right-hand side of the, the, the scaffold and out through then onto Lazare Road and heading towards Ramsey and Parliament Square. A lot of history around here. You might have heard a reference on the TT Mountain course to Gardner's Lane. Well, that is Gardner's Lane directly across at the far end of the scaffold there that takes you onto the Zare Estate. And a, a famous bit of history, which we're not going to give away too much, but we will mention that uh, the first ever helicopter rescue, would you believe, of Tony Godfrey took place when the helicopter landed in the field on the other end of this particular scaffold here at Milntown. We'll, in, we'll give you a bit more highlight on that and all the, the kind of uh, things that happened after it, which is a very interesting story. One of many we hope to be uh, keeping our guests entertained with in TT Week 2023 at the beautifully set up for everybody and everything here at Milntown House, Lazare, Ramsey, Isle of Man. Sir Clive Edwards, legend in Manx and certainly was well received on the Isle of Man. And if you have a quick lead of, read of this particular plaque, well, then it's all explained here that he left Milntown Estate for the benefit of the Manx public and the museum as well with the sidecar and various other bikes. 
and it was a centre hub for the vintage machinery around here and a centre hub for lots of things as well. ITV crews have been over here filming, they, they, they say it's haunted. I don't think the marquee we're going to be in is going to be haunted. might be haunted by a load of Australians and Americans enjoying themselves, but certainly Milntown, absolutely fabulous. And just an, another little bit of an aside, it was the first clubhouse, would you believe, of Ramsey Golf Club, going back to 1891. I've got a photograph in my collection of Manx Golf of them all sat outside Milntown House, and that goes back quite a number of years but uh, 2023 we're still here and keeping away from the haunted aspect and respecting the memory of uh, Sir John Olive, Clark, Sir John Clive Leighton Edwards Baronet. The Isle of Man has a unique history of uh, houses like this that are hidden away from the general public view but once you get the opportunity to view them, it's a uh, magnificence, really. In this day and age, when new build has got to be replaced after 20 years, you've got Milntown House here in full view and in full working order all those years later from when it was first built. It must have been earlier than 1891, for sure, because of the golf club connection. But just look at it, all the detail, the workmanship that's gone into it, and all the little kind of balustrades at the top and the, the fluted chimneys, everything connected with it is just pure quality. But uh, unless you come up that driveway, you won't see it. And uh, certainly that's one opportunity that's been taken by Manx National Heritage to highlight all these particular places round about. Absolute delight to have uh, been invited to come down and uh, see it in full, full glory, as it were. Well, that completes our tour this morning down here at Milltown House. And uh, certainly if you're interested in anything that is to offer on that, well then just book the link below.